everyone, it's Louise here from Crazy Borgies. I hope you're all fine on this lovely, lovely, what day are we today? Thursday? Yes, Thursday morning. Okay, if you're new to my channel, then welcome. And uh, first I'd like to say, if you like my content, then please like, subscribe and comment down below. And turn on your post notification bell and also follow me on TikTok and Instagram. It is Crazy Borgies Diamond Art. Okay, this morning I'm going to do um, an unboxing. I've got one small unboxing, just one diamond painting from Amazon. And I'm going to do this month's um, giveaway. I'll show you which uh, diamond painting I'm going to be putting into the monthly giveaway uh, draw that I do um, at the end of the month or beginning of next month. I usually do it in the first week of the next month. So um where are we now with june at the moment aren't we so we're nearly at the end of june already i just can't believe how quick this year's going it's crazy okay right so i'm going to do the unboxing first and then i'll do the monthly giveaway second okay so here we go right as i said this one was just a oh, a quick little one that i saw on amazon and just couldn't resist because, yes, I still look at diamond paintings on Amazon. There we go. So, there we go. This is a 30 by 40. And I will put the um, link for this diamond painting in the description box down below. So the kit that comes with it, oh, we get a squidgy in this one. So we've got a little uh, squidgy comfort holder for the pen. And then we get some baggies, we get our green tray, two bits of wax, and we get two pens, one which is just a single placer and then another one which i think may be maybe a six placer no well a nine placer i think that might be i'm not sure but it's quite a big multi-placer there so that's the kit that comes with it it is a standard normal acrylic drill which the drills look quite good condition so let me just double check the canvas item number is correct 1067 yes it is right let me just fold it or roll it even It's really cute this one I can see why well you'll know why I chose it when I show it to you now okay so it's a full drill 30 by 40 31 colors on this one so a generous amount I would say just tilt you down slightly I'm filming down here on the toy box once again because yeah, my tablecloth is just an embarrassment, guys. It really is. Okay. So. Yeah. Adhesive is okay. Not brilliant, just okay. But I can see there is some glitter in the adhesive as well. I can see it. I don't know if the camera's picking it up much. But... Anyway, so this has been printed. It looks like it is the new style of printing. To me, it does anyway. And of course, it's a chicken standing outside her barn with lots of sunflowers and, well, I think they're sunflowers. Not doing a very good job of straightening this this morning. No, it's still I'm one of those that are really fussy about this plastic covering. It 
drives me insane. It really does. There. It's a little bit better. I just do not like any wrinkles in it. There. That's one side done. 31 colours. It's quite a lot for 30 by 40, I think, or 40 by 30. need to put it underneath a couple of heavy books but I can see the, the rolls in it aren't too bad the wrinkles so it should be fine after maybe a week or so so there we go so the symbols let's have a look at them let me zoom you up sorry I've got the dog blinking on top of my legs here princess move move what is it with dogs? When you go on the floor, they they seem to seek the opportunity to pounce on you. So the print is nice and clear. As you can see, we do have a bit of colour blocking in the middle section there with the number four. Not too bad for the confetti either. There we go, and there's our chart. So we do have just a couple of funky symbols. We have zero. So we have numbers and some letters and then some symbols as well. I'm glad that they don't have O and zero because that might be a bit confusing. Let's look at R and B. Do they have B? No, they don't. They don't have a B, which is good. And then, let's see. Number eight and number three are different colours completely. C, D, yep. I can't foresee anything that should be too confusing for my eyesight. All of my eyes. We go D and O, zero. Mm, they should be okay. Yep, okay, there we go. And there's our thumbnail there. So that's what it should look like once completed. Isn't it beautiful? Is that a grasshopper there, hopping off? I think it could be. Got butterflies, grasshopper, and some beautiful, I think they are sunflowers there, or some type of flower. I just saw it and I thought, yep, yeah, got to have that one. And there's the item number and the canvas size. I'm just going to give it a quick measure now to see how it measures up actually and then we have a look at the the drills okay so it is coming in at 34 and a half but because it still has got a little bit of a creases in it from where it's been wrapped up I'd say it's 35 so it'll be 35 by 25 yes 35 by 25 so that's usually standard because they have to leave edges for the um, legend so let's have a look at these 31 colours they do have the DMC codes on the chart as well 
on the legend which is good if you store your drill leftovers via DMC codes. I don't personally, I just colour coordinate. That's how I do it. So, just checking. So the drill bags have the canvas code on as well. So let me just flip this over and we will have a look at these drills. So we have like off pinkish, dark pinkish colours there. We have a red. We have a big bag of black. We have a blue. We have another red. An orangey colour, orangey browny colour. Yellows. Yellows there. Then peach. Peachy colour. Brown. Blues. Burgundy sort of colour there. Now our greens. Wow, gorgeous, lovely shades of greens. And then another creamy colour there. Purpley shade. Another reddish pinkish shade. A dark purple. And then a lilac there on the end. And grey blue yellows blues and then a bag of white so all the drills are there they look in good quality I'm not sure if the camera is picking up but the quality of them looks really good actually I don't see many mixed up ones either which is always good so you can get some really good bargains off Amazon Definitely. And the kit is really good to come with two pens as well. So let me just hold this up, put these drills away. And then I will show you the diamond painting I have chosen for the monthly giveaway. That will have to go underneath. But I just think it's really beautiful, isn't it? The clouds in the background. A little bit of sun coming on here as well. Sunset there. Just beautiful. Really relaxing, I think that would be. And obviously I chose a chicken. Because as many of you know, my daughter is obsessed with chickens. My I have a severely autistic child. One of my youngest children is um, completely non-verbal, but she loves chickens. And we have, I'll, I'll tell you a little life update, actually. We have had a big progress with her recently because um, she is now able to use pegs, which is like um, a card, sort of like you give, pick up a a card for whatever you want you know so it's like symbolizations written on uh cards and then they choose what they want and she started signing as well and um she actually knows all her alphabet and all her colors and some numbers as well so if we say to her like uh where's green and give her colours to choose from. She'll point at the right colour. And the same. Obviously she can't physically say it. But she knows it in her mind. And she points to the right one. It's amazing. I, I was really shocked. Because you know. And this is the thing. is Sometimes when they're non-verbal like that. You just presume that it's not going in. You know. Or they don't. They're not listening to you. Or, or whatever. But it definitely is all going in because as i said you know she can point out all her correct um letters all her numbers her colors her shapes as well and i was blown away because i i didn't believe the teacher when she told me to be honest with you so i went home and um 
told my oldest and she got some colours, uh, you know, for her to choose from. Then we tried the alphabet. We just couldn't believe it. We really could not believe it because, you know, as I said, it's it's so difficult when they're kind of like locked in their own little world like that. You don't know what information they're taking in and what information they're not, which is the biggest... Um, the biggest upsetting thing of all really because they can't say to you oh i'm struggling with my reading or i'm struggling with this or i'm struggling with that because they can't communicate that so um yeah i was really blown away so that's a little bit of a a positive update life update you know that is definitely She's definitely processing that information. So that's good. I was really over the moon with that. So now I've got to order her a little textbook so she can get her cards out and chuck them at me, literally. Because <laughs> that's what she does with mum. Mum always gets a rough end of the deal. But, um, yeah. Just thought I'd share that with you. Okay. Right, so this month's monthly giveaway is this beautiful 30 by 40 partial now the reason i'm putting this in is because i didn't realize but i actually have two of these and i got them as part of a pr pack so this one in particular is from diy choose and um, my other one i think i got from somewhere else i can't remember but they're exactly the same painting, exactly the same item number, same amount of uh, drills. It comes with its crystal codes as well. And um, yeah, so I thought, well, seeing as I'm not going to diamond paint the same painting twice. So um, yeah, that's why I thought this would be the perfect one to put into this month's giveaway. So if you like partials... I mean, there is quite a lot to drill, to do, to diamond paint on this. As you can see, the print is very clear. And, yeah, I think it has a bit of a Victorian feel with all the swells and some of this sort of like almost lacy sort of frills going on around the edges. Um, but, yeah, so... It's a quick, easy, fun project to give you that um, completion, satisfaction feeling um, that sometimes when you're working on big ones, it doesn't, you know, you really just need to feel like you've achieved something sometimes. So this is the one I'm going to be putting in for the uh, giveaway this month. And I'm trying to think now. If you could just put your name and then hashtag giveaway in the comment section and then I oh, know for sure you definitely want to be put in for this giveaway this month and um, then I will upload the, um, the results when I do them. It's usually maybe a couple of weeks I'll leave it for this time because not really sure no actually maybe next week maybe next week i'll see how I, how i go next week and um because i've got quite a few unboxings to do next week but i'll see how i get on and um possibly next week I'll, I'll leave it this video up for at least a week to give you guys a chance to enter for it and then yeah so literally all you have to do is put your name louise if it was me, I was entering myself. I put Louise hashtag giveaway. That's all you have to do, guys. <coughs> Pardon me. Right, so that's all I've got for you this morning, I'm afraid, guys. Because I'm going to try and do some floss tube video now. So if you're interested in cross stitch, then, you know, um, look out for that video. That will be coming maybe tomorrow. And... Um, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, subscribe and follow me on TikTok and Instagram. Crazy Borgies <coughs> Diamond Art. I don't know what is going on with my voice this morning. So, yeah. So, there we go. We've got that 
for the monthly giveaway and this gorgeous unboxing of this chickadee i call them chickadees lovely beautiful i'm getting a nice collection of chickens and sunflowers now they seem to be my my go-to theme at the moment anyway take care of yourselves and i hope you all have a beautiful remainder of your thursday and it has cooled down quite nicely here in the UK, so I am really happy about that because I'm not one for the heat. It was just way too hot for my liking yesterday. So I'm glad it has cooled down and it's a bit cloudy today, so it gives us a break. It gives us a break from that heat. But anyway, stay safe, stay blessed and um, stay positive and look after yourselves and most importantly look after your loved ones too and uh, god bless and i'll speak to you all soon take care bye for now bye